For this test, we will be using the following items. A notebook to record the results, funnel, graduated glass sand content tube, spray bottle filled with water, sieve with a 74 micron screen, rinse water, and Setco drilling fluid. We begin this test by filling the graduated glass sand content tube to the line marked mud to here. Next, we fill the same graduated glass sand content tube to the line marked water to here. Once both drilling fluids have been added, place your thumb over the top of the graduated glass sand con tube and shake well. Empty the contents of the graduated glass sand content tube through the 74 micron sieve. Tapping the side of the sieve will help break surface tension and speed up the testing process. Rinse the graduated glass sand content tube with water, each time pouring it through the sieve until no traces of sand remain. Use the squirt bottle to rinse the screen thoroughly to remove any drilling fluid or silts that may have been trapped. If you're using a polymer slurry, it is useful to use bleach water for this portion of the test. Once rinsed, place the funnel over the top of the sieve, then flip it over onto the top of the graduated glass sand content tube. Finally, use the spray bottle to rinse the contents of the sieve into the graduated glass sand content tube. After the graduated glass sand content tube has been allowed to settle, read the graduations at the base of the tube. This drilling fluid contains 0.25% sand. For help with your next project, visit setco.com forward slash dpg where you will find detailed product information and our handy product usage calculators.